What's going on guys, Matt Wask here. Welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video. Today I wanna to share with you guys how you can set up your on-page SEO to help you rank for other keywords that your main headline is not about. So for example, let's say you are building a site for a lawn care business. You want it, the homepage, let's say it's based in Houston, Texas, for example. If you want it to rank for not only lawn care, but you also want to rank it for lawn mowing, lawn care service, lawn service, lawn maintenance, grass cutting, all the different variables. I wanna show you guys how to do that in this video with a free tool which you can use and it basically helps you with determining what type of wording you want to throw on your website in terms of the headlines especially and also throw it into your content. So let's go hop into my computer and I'm gonna show you guys how to do this. All right, so welcome into my computer. So the tool that I mentioned earlier is called lsigraph.com and an LSI is an acronym for Latent Semantic Indexing. I'm not going to get into the full technical analysis of this because it's really not needed. The goal that I have for you with this video is that you will take this website, put it to use with your own website to figure out basically how to use synonyms of the keyword that you're targeting on your on-page SEO. So these different types of synonyms would be used in your keywords as well as in your content and even in the alternate tags that you have on your images. So what we're basically doing is, let's say we're trying to build a site for lawn care. I know that there are a lot of people here on the channel that really don't seem to know a whole lot about industries. So if you're someone who is brand new to this and you're brand new to lead gen, you're brand new to the industry or the niche that you're trying to, that you're trying to research because you wanna build a site because you want to rank it and then get traffic and start either selling the leads or generating calls for an affiliate network, this tool will help you. So what you basically would wanna do is input the service that it is that you are trying to rank for. So in this instance, we'll just say lawn care. So there are other variations of what potential customers are going to enter into Google when they are searching for that service. So they're not always going to put lawn care and then the city. They're not always gonna put lawn care service or lawn service even. They're gonna put lawn mowing, they're going to put lawn care companies, lawn care maintenance companies, yard maintenance companies, yard services, yard cleanup services, lawn spraying. The list just goes on and on and on and on. I mean, even down to someone to cut my grass. And you could slip that type of phrase somewhere in your content, maybe in a paragraph that says, we are the best crew to cut your grass, for example. So obviously you don't want to take it just straight out of this and put it into a paragraph that does not make sense because again you are writing for people yes you're writing for google bots and we want to rank but we want to be writing our pages in a manner that when someone's reading it it makes sense to them so again if you're someone who does not speak english very well or you can't type english very well you're going to have to learn otherwise you're not going to convert you're going to be putting a lot of time into a website that's not going to convert anybody. You could be ranking number one, but if the site either looks spammy or it reads really bad with just improper English, people are gonna leave the site and you're gonna not generate any revenue from it. So take a quick look at an example here, and this is a client we had picked up recently building out their website, and this is what their homepage looks like. So as you can see, we have the city that they are targeting, basically where their headquarters is, and then we have best lawn care service. This is all H1 font. You only want to have one H1 on your page. So then we get down here and we change it up a little bit from just lawn care service to just lawn care. And again, these are going to be H2 fonts down here and landscaping specialists. Now this could be changed out to experts as well. A lot of people will go to Google and type in landscaping expert near me, for example. So you want to have those types of words. Really just the big takeaway from this is use adjectives that are going to make the business sound really, really good, really trustworthy and really knowledgeable and match that up with their services. So then shift them around a little bit and play around with the variation and you're going to set yourself up good with your on page as far as ranking for different keywords. So down here we have another variation which is outdoor services. And so then another variation here, lawn maintenance and landscape installation, not just landscaping, changing it up from landscaping. And then we get down here, your trusted local lawn maintenance and landscape company. You could also change this up for contractor. Local is good to have in there as well, especially if it is an actual local business. So there's a quick example of how you can set up your on page. So that way you can basically do like mentioned earlier with not leaving a single stone 
unturned by maximizing the amount of keywords that your page can rank in because you have that on-page SEO on par. And as you start building up that authority, of course, then you start ranking and taking up the top spot there in the search results. So if you enjoyed this type of content and learning these types of skill sets, I'd appreciate if you went down below, dropped a like on this video. And if you're not already a part of the family, go down below, smash that subscribe button. And if you want to learn more in-depth information when it comes to building websites, ranking them in the search engines, and monetizing them with paper call affiliate or lead generation offers, there's a link down below to my course. And if you want to get access to the nine most profitable paper call and, and lead gen niches, there is a link to download that in the description as well. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow in the next one.